Glenn Stout with HSPN Sports. We're on the campus of Atlantic Community High School here with the head coach of the – it's the Eagles, right, Coach? Yes, sir. Yes, okay, sir. it's the Eagles, and it's T.J. Jackson. And, T.J., you've had a week that they've been able to be out of school. They've been able to uh, do whatever they want to do. How is it that you manage it and make sure their time is used wisely to get ready for one of the biggest games of some of their lives? We try to keep everything normal uh, as much as possible. Uh, having practice about the same time that we normally have when they're in school. Trying to just focus on talking to the parents and communicate with the kids about just trying to stay off their feet and rest their body a little. But, you know, it's the holiday season. It's tough. Kids want to go shopping with their parents. Kids want to, you know, whether it's grocery shopping or going into the mall looking for things for Christmas. So it's tough for the most part. Uh, I think the parents have been trying to work with as much as possible and just helping keep the kids off their feet. Well, when we came up earlier, what was impressive to me was you had the team huddled up out there. I don't know if you've had practice already, but you had some a young man talking to him. And um, is that something you regularly do is bring mentors in to give them that inspiration, to give them the real life, what it's going to look like at the next level? Yeah, um, especially during the summertime. Uh, we have a lot of NFL guys that come and train with the kids and work with the kids. Uh, and Mike Pouncey, Marquise Pouncey, and uh, Eric Berry, all those guys. Uh, Mark Ingram does a great job of mentoring the kids, taking them out to lunch and just talking to them, but also just keep mentoring them on the football field and just keep preaching to them about education, doing the right things in the community, and uh, just staying positive uh, with life. Uh, um, you know, a lot of these kids go to a lot of adversity. And, uh, so they get a lot of mentors and they get a lot of uh, things, especially from this great principal here at Atlanta Community High School as well. Well, after talking to them, and I'm glad you're able to, I'm able to interview after talking to them and getting this one right, but after talking to them and listening to them, you really inspire a lot of things that they need to know and how to articulate and really to be able to think about their thoughts and to be able to express their thoughts. Is there something that you do with them besides on the field that's in the classroom or some type of other mentoring that you do with them to instill that with them? Because they're a great young group of kids. We do a lot of mentoring in the summertime. Uh, I know a lot of teams doing do, do go around doing seven on seven. We utilize that to try to educate our kids as being an overall student athlete and overall citizen of this uh, community of the United States. So uh, we don't do a lot of seven on seven in the summertime. We try to focus on the kid as a, as a whole. That's fantastic to hear, and, and we all about that in the Keep Your Dreams Alive Foundation. And, Coach, we're here to support you in any way we can in Palm Beach and come up and do the things we do. Obviously, we're going to cover you on Friday night. We want to wish you the best of luck semifinal game. Um, next game, it's, your, it's really your doorway to Orlando, and we want to see you do well and keep the kids healthy, and um, you're just doing a great job with these young men. Thank you for being with us tonight. Thank you guys for driving down. I appreciate it. For taking the time. All right, folks, that's uh, T.J. Jackson. And uh, we're going to sign off here. Uh, we're going to show you the kids. The, uh, the young men are f phenomenal. You're going to get to hear their interviews. Again, if you want to make a comment and, uh, you know, let TJ and Onlo right down here. It's a comment. Give us a thumbs up. We know there's 600,000 of you watching, 800 college coaches. Got a great group of kids up here that you can recruit, and you'll get to see them in just a moment. Again, this is Glenn Stout with HSPN Sports. Good night.